Hey, what's up, guys? It's Arlie, and today I am making a video that I never thought I would make on YouTube. But uh, the channel, thank you, it just passed 12 million, 12 million views, and it, it's crazy. Um, 12 million viewers. Um, obviously, that translates to ad money. So um, this month so far, this is j like this is um. This month, so starting off, you can see my views are pretty much down because usually I make more than that. But lately, I just haven't been creating a lot of content. That's just because I'm trying to figure out what I kind of want to do on YouTube next. I might start sacrificing uploading stuff I want to make versus um, making stuff that works just for the sake of uh, making, uh, I guess, more monetized content and plus for the sake of not really trying to make like I'm not really trying to make that much money either if that makes sense I'm not trying to get a lot of views either I'm just simply trying to like broaden what type of content I make but so far dude like um, this is what I've made I think in the last 28 days or maybe I don't know um, and it's not that I can't make more than 49 bucks it's just that I'm not really I literally haven't lately been trying hard on YouTube um, because I'm just trying to focus more on uploading stuff I actually want to make like I said so um, just to show you guys like here's the watch time here's the views now this is not accurate because this month just started and this stuff this is ultimately going down I probably made more than this in the past 28 days but if you know how YouTube works it like the analytics like once it's a new month they start going down unless you're already uploading so um, yeah I just wanted to show you guys how much I make now it's all about consistency if you want to start making money on YouTube and getting ads on videos not every video is gonna do well. I have videos sometimes that do maybe a thousand views sometimes 50 views sometimes I get videos that do a hundred thousand views and the crazy part is sometimes I have videos that don't necessarily make a lot of money just because they have a lot of views and watch time. Like I had one video that got I think 600k views and it only made me over the course of a couple of months I think it made me like 400, 500 bucks which is not bad by any means but um I've had videos that had a lot of views also that didn't make a cent. And sometimes that can be a copyright claim or simply because the advertisers don't want to put their ads on a video. YouTube has so many factors that you have to consider when making content. And I think it's more so like you should be making content and you should be treating it as, you know, just something you like to do. And I would say being consistent, uploading every single day, even if you post multiple videos a day, I think that's the guide to actually growing on YouTube. Um, and making sure your thumbnails are cool, your titles are interesting. And I think that's all it is at the end of the day. And sometimes making stuff that does help you grow is the best thing to do too. Um, so I just wanted to take you guys through my analytics. I'm not using YouTube Studio. I know this is controversial. Most YouTubers would not want to show this. But yeah, um, like this. So I've uploaded these many videos. And I just want to show you guys like, so I have control that video right there that's gotten a hundred and some views and see what I mean someone's got 14 someone's got a hundred and something like it it did my newest videos got seven views one's got three one's got one it's all about being consistent and just like your views are not gonna always be up you have to understand that as you grow as a channel um, that you gotta you gotta kind of do it in rapid succession like you gotta be uploading in rapid succession consistently every day and it gets to a point to where people understand okay this channel he's constantly uploading or he she is constantly uploading that I like the content then they may subscribe then they turn on notifications next thing you know you have a huge following of people just coming back over and over and like I said, your watch time and click-through rate is important. It doesn't matter if someone clicked on your video and watched it. If they only, if you got a 10-minute video and they only watch for one minute, 
how do you think that's gonna affect the performance versus if you have a 10 minute video they clicked on it and they watched it for six minutes you need to consider uh, what kind of video you're going to make and how engaging it's going to be I'm not the greatest at this stuff and I'm still learning how to use YouTube but it's a great opportunity to know that I was able to gain subscribers and people you know chose to click the subscribe button they could have easily not clicked that subscribe button and chose to say your channel is crap and leave but anyways this was Arlie Gamer I hope you enjoyed this this uh, channel analytics thing video showing you how much I make on YouTube I guess at least for now um, it's like I said some months you know it's not 49 bucks sometimes it's 300 bucks sometimes it can be upwards to a thousand it's all about how much videos I'm posting and how many people are watching and about how many ads are being monetized or how many video views are being monetized it it's a fluctuating thing you never really know how much you're making um, would I say it's stable I think YouTube is stable once you get to a certain amount of subscriber base I've heard a lot of youtubers say hey you know once I reached uh, 100k subs once I reached 100k subs and have this amount of viewership I knew it's time that I could maybe leave my job or you know whatever it was and that I just want to show people it's it's possible because for the longest people told me that I, I wasn't able to grow on YouTube and stuff so I just want to show people it's possible and that you can do it if you work really hard anyways thank you so much for watching and